Hi, everybody. Uh, my name is Timothy Trespass, and I am a targeted individual. For those of you who know what that is, there's nothing need to be said. But for those of you who don't, targeted individual is somebody who has been chosen by whatever reason uh, for human experimentation. Uh, we were given Morgellons disease, and we were put through an MK Ultra style uh, mind control program. We're still being tortured. Anyway, the reason I'm making this video is uh, not for myself, actually, but for another guy. Uh, this man's name is Guillermo, Guillermo Schroeder. Guillermo Schroeder. And he lives on 1728 Glendale Boulevard in Los Angeles. That's Echo Park, downtown Los Angeles. Now this guy, he's uh, in his 30s or so. He's a concert pianist. He's an accomplished musician. And he's also a targeted individual. Uh, he's desperate. I mean, uh, he's calling me up. He's crying. He's, he's, he needs help. He needs somebody to talk to. He needs fellowship of other targeted individuals. And uh, they keep crashing his computer and blowing up his hard drives. He's having problems staying online. And what he, he, he asked me to do is to put his name and address and phone number out on one of my videos uh, asking for people in his neighborhood or his area or just anybody with the willingness to reach out to this man either call him or, or uh, email him uh, I'll put the email address in the, in the underneath you know in the, on the page uh, but he's, he's really looking for fellowship just somebody he can talk to and, bounce ideas off of about shielding and, and you know talk about the overwhelming nature of this as I'm sure many of you understand uh, isolation is uh, one of the things that our, our perpetrators the watchers try to, to force us into self-induced or, or outside induced isolation cut us off from our friends from our family from our job, from our community, from our children, our relatives, our loved ones. Uh, and we end up alone and frightened. Uh, that's what they want. It's not what I want. It's not what you want. So uh, what I'm doing is I'm putting a call out for fellowship for this man, Guillermo Schroeder, in Echo Park, downtown Los Angeles. Um, his number will be posted and his email address will be posted. This is something that I think that everybody needs to consider. Uh, if you're watching this video, then you understand the need of fellowship. Uh, if you're making videos of your own, I encourage you. That's good. If you're not doing it yet, please do. The world needs to see how many victims there are. When I go online and I look at you know what's going on in the world I get email updates every time somebody posts something about target individual or Mark Allen's and I go online and I look for other victims and I look at their stories and I listen to what they have to say they contact me I contact them fellowship is truly important in this because isolation you know we all know where that goes being tortured and alone in your mind being drugged and tortured electromagnetically is not fun and even though talking to other people about it doesn't stop it, it is very helpful to know that there are other human beings out there that see the world, you know, that, that understand what's going on, that this is being done to also. I found in my discussions with people, family, strangers, that for non-targets or non-perpetrators to talk about this information, for many people is extremely difficult and I spent a lot of time trying to figure out why this is you know and I think that it's because once you understand the depth and breadth of what's being done who's doing it and the possible reasons why they could be doing it uh, it basically causes you to realize that almost everything that you've learned, all the things that you've been taught during your life about how the world works, how people are, how politics work, how the country is, how the international, you know, all these things, you find out are lies that you've been lied to every day of your life since you were born. Uh, 
I mean, there's all kinds of people pushing this system forward and, and pretending, thinking the world is still the way it was when they grew up. Uh, as those of us who are targeted know, the world is no longer like it was when they grew up. Um, anyway, the brain fog, the Morgellons brain fog has caused me to lose my train of thought. But, um... Please, if there's anybody out there who is in Los Angeles who feels like giving this guy a call, he's an interesting man, his English isn't so good, so if he speaks Spanish, that's even better, he's from Brazil, but a very interesting man, nice guy, he's suffering horribly, they're torturing him, they're not torturing his wife, so they're basically trying to split them up first, you know, uh, they did that with me and, and Petra for a while, they would drug her, so I think she was crazy, then they drugged me, so she thought I was crazy, didn't matter to us, we were in love, so... I think that uh, we knew somewhere inside that none of us was crazy and that something really bad was happening. Um, anyway, that's what this video is. It's a call for fellowship. So if there's anyone out there that, that can help this guy, give him a call. Just talk to him. It would be wonderful. And for the rest of you out there watching this video, if you're not making videos about your story, about being targeted, about the horrible things that are happening to you, who is going to know? You know, it's time to stand up and tell the world you count, you exist, and this is what's being done to you. Even if you don't understand it, even if you don't know why or who or where, stand up and be counted. The world has to know. Thank you for your time. Yeah, may God have mercy on us all.